Hey y'all, what's good? What's good? What's good? This your girl Rika the Empress, and yes, I'm back in the building. I'm about to do a collective reading. Sorry, I was a fly in my house is getting my nerves. I'm about to do a collective reading for Council All Placements. If you haven't already, please, 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 and thank you. Like, share, and subscribe to the channel. That way you can get all the notifications. Make sure you click all notifications. Um, if you're interested in a personal reading or any products or services that I have to offer, all the info will be in the description box below. Also, if you would like to follow me on my social media platforms, you can click on it in the About Me section. All right, let's get started. What's going on for my Cancerians? All placements. What's going on? Okay, Cancers, you could be dealing with a toxic relationship. You can be in a toxic relationship with a player. This person is very toxic. Toxic doesn't always have to be violent. It can be a form of emotional abuse. Uh, financial abuse, emotional manipulation. I don't know. I just feel like somebody playing games. I don't know. I just heard they're playing games. So. Yeah, there's some di dis there's some incompatibility and some difference with you. You, Yeah, you and this person is having a problem trying to make amends. Or this person is currently having a problem trying to make amends with you. Give me one second, guys. Sorry, guys. But yeah, I'm back. Let's see. What's going on with my Cancerians? There's some unexpected communication coming in or something that you saw. Something blew your mind away. It's something that you received that unexpectedly got you like, wow. Somebody can literally saw something on their phone. This could be from somebody who has some unfinished business with you. Somebody could be receiving some um communication from someone. Someone that they have an unfinished connection with, they possibly ghosted them, or is ghosting them. Somebody could have received that. Yeah, there's a player energy coming in. Yeah, they're having some type of disappointment and regrets about a situation. Mm -hmm. So this was going on. Whoever the player is in this situation, they're going through some type of regrets and disappointments. I feel like this person possibly regret the things they did because they realized they were being toxic to you. Wow, you see what came out, right? Yeah, there is some type of relationship or stability or security that they was possibly trying to avoid. I think this person was trying to, yeah. This person was trying to avoid being in a relationship with you. There is some type of stability and security that somebody kept trying to push away and avoid. Somebody was running from you. Something that was very secure and stable, possibly family. But there was a breakup or something happened in the situation as far as someone that you were connecting with. So, yeah, somebody has a new love. Yeah, somebody wants a new opportunity. They want to give you some new love. Do some man regrets about a situation. This person has a strong desire and passion and chemistry for you. They feel like you're a soulmate. So this was going on. Um, you're going. Something is going to happen where you're going to see something from someone. Yeah, somebody is going to surrender to whatever this situation is. Yeah, somebody wants to surrender. Janae Eco song come out. So don't be surprised if uh, when I do my uh, my index cards that come out, somebody wants to surrender and date you home again. There is something that is going on with this person. It could be some type of unexpected communication. All right, what uh, hidden messages do you got for cancer? All placements. What hidden messages do you have for cancers? All right, I keep saying this. Somebody might got uh, somebody might got uh, crabs, pubic lice. Somebody you could be dealing with a Capricorn. This person could, uh, you got happy people. That's amazing, Frankie Beverly. Somebody could be happy. Somebody could want to marry you for love or be or marry someone from love. Whoever this person is, this person could be having sex with your friend. Or your friend could be having sex with your man. Uh, this person might have a, a Aquarius moon. Someone is mad because you walked away. There is some type of a karmic relationship that you could be dealing with. Or somebody's angry that somebody walked away. Uh, there's some type of entanglement energy going on with this situation. 
So if you could be dealing with someone with an Aquarius moon or a Capricorn sun, whoever this person is, this could be somebody a little older, especially with this maze energy coming out. This person possibly married somebody for love. This person, uh, you can have a friend that's uh, have a sex with your man. Uh, it could be an Aries energy in, so you could be an Aries uh, rising. Well, you could be dealing with an Aries sun sign. Uh, somebody could be a Virgo rising. You could be dealing with a Taurus sun sign. This could be in your uh, charts. Somebody might have antisocial disorder. Uh, somebody lied about how many kids they got, too. Somebody wants to spoil you or dreams of living a certain type of lifestyle with the dream, the song Fancy. That's about him spoiling the energy. There is someone that is addicted to your energy. Somebody is a BBW or likes BBWs. Uh, anything else? Anything else? There's somebody that wants a new beginning with you. Somebody lying about how many kids they got, too. They're addicted to your energy. So, Cancer, you can be dealing with a, a Taurus sign or Aries sign. Sun sign. Uh, somebody is in a karmic relationship with some entanglement energy. Somebody is addicted to your energy and they're mad because you walked away. Somebody might be a little antisocial. That's their personality disorder, but they just don't want to be around anybody. Somebody could be a Capricorn sun, too. So these are the three people you could be dealing with. Uh, somebody could be a Virgo rising or Aquarius moon. So it could be a Capricorn that you're dealing with that's a Virgo rising and has an Aquarius moon. You could be dealing with a Taurus that has a Virgo rising and an Aquarius moon. You could be dealing with an Aries sun that is a Virgo rising and an Aquarius moon. But either way, somebody's lying about how many kids they got. Somebody had an STD. Somebody married for love. Somebody's friend is fucking a man. Somebody is a BBW or like BBWs. Somebody has an antisocial personality disorder where they don't like to be around people like that. But I see the energy of karma and entanglement energy. So whoever these people are, this right now is what this person is, is dealing with. That's why you got uh, lied about how many kids they got because they were dealing with a karmic relationship with somebody. Somebody's friend has sex with their man. Somebody is fancy. You might be a fancy type of person, and this person is addicted to your energy, and you mad you walked away. That's where that antisocial personality disorder coming at. Somebody's mad because you walked away, but that's because you just decided to cut back your energy. So who the fuck lies about how many kids they got? So that's petty. Or somebody could be lying about um, having kids, period. Look, bottom of the deck, bad big girl. Somebody is very attractive and gorgeous. If you are a big girl, somebody think you bad. You understand me? Look, big dick energy. Somebody would, they got some big dick energy, think you a bad motherfucker. You hear me? But this is a, uh, icky pig. Surprise that ain't came out. But those are the messages that I have for you, counsel. Hit you up later, babies.